Hello, welcome back to unbottle a or should I say unbox a but I don't do any unboxings, I just literally do drinks because that's what I'm interested in at the moment. Um, today we've got two Pepsis, but can you notice anything here? Uh, Pepsi have decided in the UK to switch a roux, the flavour, um, completely change the recipe and not really tell anyone, it's been really low key, they've kept the price the same um, and taken pretty much, let me get you a better view all the sugar out of it so it's basically a diet pepsi now but they're marketing it as a regular pepsi for some reason um still charging the same there's a sugar there's a thing called sugar tax in the uk for people that don't know where if you have too much sugar in your drink you get taxed on it um but pepsi have done a thing where they've taken the sugar out like i said before but keep the price the same so i paid the same price for these two bottles um one's got sweetener in it one doesn't there's the things for you the ingredients um yeah like i say it's kind of not very nice of them i've seen a few news articles on it but i think that's only because i follow a page on facebook um that tells you about when they make changes to drinks so it's very difficult to find this information out unless you look for it really i don't think they've done many statements on it um yeah if they have they don't really tell you what they've done they just said they just say that they've changed the recipe uh but don't just tell you straight up that they've um put the sweeteners in it and taken basically all the sugar out but yeah i'm gonna give them a taste test see uh which one i prefer which is going to be obvious because artificial sweeteners don't really make drinks taste very nice in my opinion can already smell that classic Pepsi smell coming out of that one. Let's get this other one open. I noticed when I was carrying them home from the shop, uh, this one had bubbles around the top for longer than the other one. Let's see if that happens when you open it. Like that, they've, they've gone on this bottle already, but it takes them a while to disappear on the top of that one for some reason. But yeah, it smells of Pepsi in here now, so I'm gonna taste this one first because otherwise it'll be a warm overpower this one I'm sure it still tastes like Pepsi but it's just a little bit of an off taste like you can definitely tell that they've taken the sugar out of it um added just the artificialness they really shouldn't be marketing it as just regular Pepsi in my opinion um they should change the whole thing if they want to do that um and then i'm just going to give the regular i know what this tastes like obviously that's just a classic you can't really deny that this one is a million times better it's just the classic pepsi so pepsi is quite a disappointment really uh i don't think they're doing this in the usa just the uk but you just shouldn't change your original recipe keep it the same uh I may, I may add that uh, Pepsi is owned, well, not owned, but distributed by Britvic Soft Drinks in the UK. I think they make stuff like Tango and that. So, yeah, Pepsi, get your act together. Pe people might not like this once they find out that you've just changed it without really saying much. Yeah, that's this has been a more serious Unbox One today. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you at the next Unbox One.